All right, so apparently we're here at a place where there's a thousand lingas. So this should be interesting because um, apparently it's like a hike now, which is about a half an hour. Half an hour up the mountain or something. We'll see what happens. So we won't record all of it because I don't want the battery to die. We'll get some of the recording on the way up. And then uh, we'll resume when we uh, finally get there. But we'll do a few minutes anyways. Creek run through <whistles> listen to all the I guess we're sort of in a jungle jungle sounds. I wonder if I'll see any monkeys. Smoke. I tell ya, I'm not fooling around here. These stones, stones and boulders are worn smooth. I don't know which way to go. <laughs> I guess we go this way. Wow. <laughs> he wasn't kidding. He said this is a hike. Made sure I had enough water. I guess. Thank you. 
here's some civilization, so possibly could be a good thing. Thank God it quit smoking cigarettes. Ten years ago. Starting to huff and puff here already. Only went 200 meters. Another 1300 to go. This is a job I needed. Nice and chill. Hanging out. I guess they sweep the uh, pathway and keep it nice and presentable. It's humid today. Well, it's well maintained, that's for sure. Oh boy. I think we brought a picnic with them. All right. Well, we're at the thousand meter mark. <clears throat> Started at 1500, so another kilometer. At least a little flat here. The calm before the storm.
can imagine the thousands of people, the thousands that came up and down here. This is interesting. I don't think I'd want to do this at night. and puff in here. Oh. Coming up to more stairs. have one heck of a view once I'm up there. All right. Okay, we'll shut her down for a bit. detour away, but we made it in one piece anyway. Yeah, well, I'm soaking wet. I'm not from the water. <laughs> A little tiny pool. There must be more here to what meets the eye. I don't think I'm in the right place yet. I think it's above. Probably got to go up them stairs. Over here. There's some stairs that are going up here. Slippery rocks. I'm glad I brought my uh, semi uh, hiking boots, running shoes. Yeah. All right, well, we're going up the stairs. More stairs. Oh my God. 
Oh, it's a shoe here. I go this way, I guess. Oh, yeah, I don't know what you guys did. I don't know what you guys did. Oh, that's a twisted plant right there. Twisted vine. Hundred meter mark. Oh, okay. Not so bad. Another hundred meters to go. Probably lost a kilo in fluid. But I feel good. up here. Snooping. Dogs over there. I guess this is the village. But he's just telling me. Go the other way. And so is the dog.
All right. All right. I think we're here. Whatever here is. Just chilling. Oh, I made it. Jeez. <laughs> ah, wow. Okay, so this is worth the uh, 15. Don't step there. Interesting. This is interesting holes here. Usually rocks spin around, but this is very interesting over here. Wow. Somebody had nothing better to do than climb, you know, all the way up the mountain and carve this stuff into the rocks. I'm absolutely drenched. <laughs> absolutely soaked. I think I, I could actually wring my shirt out. There's so much sweat in it. And all I can do is taste salt from all the fish sauce probably that I'm using. Something was starting to be carved out, almost like a quarry, this place.
not too much sweat. Can actually wring my shirt out. But you know what? It's nice. Nice and cool here. Yeah, what a spot. What a place to come and carve a bunch of things, you know? All the way up here. film video from uh, this side and then I guess we'll uh, go the other uh, kilometer and a half back down again <laughs> maybe I'll just be absolutely drenched look I just shake it and uh, my sweats just dripping off my shirt maybe I'll stop and just have a quick drink or something have some tea. time is it? It's about uh, 25 to 11 and it's sort of overcast today so which is wonderful. It's not brutally hot it's just freaking humid. God the humidity's got to be 80 90 percent. All right. I think they were selling some energy drinks or something back there. Grab a can of some cold, whatever they got. side of the river here.
No monkeys. I haven't seen any monkeys. Maybe they're not around these parts. All right. It's a lot of carving. I'm not kind of sure what kind of stone this is. But it sure took a lot of effort. Looks like somebody busted their hands off. Looks like four heads. Brahma. Very beautiful. Look like a carving down there of, uh, I guess that's Vishnu reclining, and he might have Lakshmi with him, his consort near his side, possibly. Let's have a closer look. <clears throat> yeah, it could be. Could be, uh, could be her there. It looks like her face has been uh, taken off. You could have them all, Brahma, Vishnu, and Shiva, possibly. But very nice uh, carving of Vishnu. Very nice. Deciding which way to go. go this way. What the hell? Look at this, like, camel... Camel tree. Right? All different camouflage-looking colors. That is so wild. <sighs> cool. What's that? Go this way? Hmm. Go down to the waterfall. Okay. Oh, I did that already. I went down to the waterfall that way. La Riva. Okay. 
Does somebody uh, sell drink? Yeah. Who? Yeah. yeah. Okay, whoops. You just, uh, all right, well, it just so happens you uh, had a cooler here. Ended up having a couple wobbly pops. And there was a policeman up here. So I bought him a beer. <laughs> we had a beer together. Okay. So let me see. See over here. I'm moving a little too quick. It's kind of ugh, not so easy here. But uh, I'll spin it around because you're not here to see me. You're here to see the carvings in the stone up here. I'm not going to crawl down there. It's roped off anyways, but you can see. I'm on top of this big, huge rock, big, huge boulder. I think it's gigantic. What's hiding here, under here, nothing. Hmm. Okay. <clears throat> Dollar a beer <laughs> on the top of a mountain in the middle of nowhere. Buy a beer for a buck. <clears throat> Take it easy here. I don't want to twist an ankle or anything. Jesus, that would be brutal trying to get down this thing. I'm happy I selected these boots. My hiking, hiking quasi running shoe hikers, waterproof shoes. <clears throat> oh yeah, here look, the thousand lingus. I mean, wow. It's all carved with these tiny little lingers. Amazing. Okay, well, we're just going to follow along this uh, little path just beside the river and uh, see what else is in store here. Attention, man, you're going to bend, twist an ankle. Or... I'll stay on this path, it's a little wider. I'll go back and have a look and see over there, but this looks like the easier way to get around. Okay. 
back over here. Oh, that's cool. I think that's where I came from down there earlier. More language. We talk about a thousand. I think there's more than a thousand. They just don't stop. Cool. Who needs rope? We'll just grab a vine and we'll just put it through the Put it through the concrete posts. Ah, this is so cool in here. Wow, besides temperature. So interesting. Look at this, neat rocks. This could be interesting here. Oh, burning garbage. What the hell? Oh. Yeah. Interesting. I believe I was down there already. go this way around. Isn't this interesting? A little grotto, I think. Huh. Looks like there possibly could have been um, some sort of statues in here. We have the bases. Anyways, we're going to keep moving. Exit. <laughs> Thank you. Jeez. Oh, I see. I went up the other way. And these, uh, these stairs are like ladders. <coughs> that one was. This one isn't so bad.
All right, get a little shot of me coming over here. I'm going to kill myself. Probably all slippery. down this way. This way, I guess. got out of here. <sighs> Which is the path out of here now? Came in here. Way to get up there. <laughs> well, I guess we're going back up here. Up the ladder and turn right. There is a right. back this way. <laughs> oh my god.
All right, back down. Only a kilometer and a half to go. Well, at least it's downhill this time, mostly. I gotta get one of those hammocks. It just seems that wherever you are around midday, string up a hammock and just uh, chill out for a while. Actually, it'd be a lot of time. The sun hits my sun scanner, my uh, bald head, <clears throat> you can definitely feel it through the uh, shady little trees here. Interesting, and everywhere along the trail, we have uh, different, uh, you know, <clears throat> different trees and the names in Latin in English and come here hello hello how are you talk to you about yourselves oh, you. wonderful wonderful it was worth the walk all the way up here anyways. It's definitely interesting. Hello. Hello. You're going out. Not so much huffing and puffing. Steady. Yeah, what is it? It's uh, 10 after 11. Now it's going to start getting hot. But the good thing is, we're in a little shady part of the jungle, I guess you could say. up with them. <laughs> He's running up the mountain. Hmm. 
All right, so 20 minutes. We usually don't add it too much, so. I could do another uh, 10 minutes of my struggle. here we're gonna just uh, shut her down for a minute all right well on the way down the mountain just happened to see some people standing uh, off to the side of the trail and uh, this is what you see is absolutely fantastic. We'll go too close to the edge, but I, I don't think I want to get any closer than this. What a view. On the edge of a precipice. Go ahead. Wait. Well, I'm going that way. <laughs> I got to go this way and around. <laughs> hey, it's worth the walk all the way up there. Thank you. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> I was dry when I started. I'm absolutely soaking wet. And we're at the 800 meter mark, so that's not too bad. Only 800 meters to go. <clears throat> but at least it's downhill. Again, we were at the, I turned it on at an 800 meter mark. But believe me, it's a lot easier going down than it is going up. Just take your time. Don't want to twist an ankle, roll an ankle or whatever. Okay, we're at the stairs. Oh, all right. Again, you can never show how steep things are in the camera, but believe me, it's not quite a ladder. Nicely, it's not too bad. But we've got a long 
Way to go down. Yeah, a lot easier going down than going up. And for the ones that don't want to use the stairs, you can go down there. Flying down here. Absolutely flying down. Like just these stairs has got to be at least four stories. Easy, easy peat skis. Okay, I'm going to uh, relax here for a minute. Not relax here, I'm just going to shut her down because I want to pull in the camera, make it a little smaller because this next part's a little tricky. Talk to you soon. All right, for those on the edge of their seats. Wondering if I survived that section or not. I did. No, it's not so bad here. <clears throat> yeah, like, uh, pretty interesting. I mean, all that carving, all that stuff, that was a lot of effort up there. You know, I don't think it was just like one hermit, you know, living up on the mountain by himself over his lifetime, did all that. Could have been a group of people, I don't know. Maybe I should get a guide sometimes, maybe they know more than me when it comes to all that stuff. But hey, what a nice little hike anyways. I can't believe how soaking wet I am. I haven't been this soaking wet. I can't remember. The last time, yeah, when uh, maybe when I was uh, working in construction in my 20s and 30s, working outside when it was like maybe 85 degrees out or something, and I'm slugging away. But <clears throat> I was slugging away. Here I am, I'm only walking. And uh, wow. I mean, I'm soaked everywhere. <laughs> I mean, even my... Too much information? Underwear soaking wet. To my socks. Everything. Tip of my toes to the top of my head. I don't think there's a dry spot on me. Uh, hello. <laughs> Only another thousand meters. <laughs> More than thousand meters. <laughs> it's worth it. Hello. <laughs> okay. This is another tricky little section. We just take our time. You have to calculate every step. No rush.
came to a juncture. Okay. All right, so we'll set time again. And what I might do is not bore everybody to death. I know everybody's waiting for me to fall. <laughs> no, just kidding. Oh, once you see the camera go tumbling all the way down the mountain. Oh, that was good. Little trip hazard. beaten path, but that's okay. It's a lot easier. Maybe that's why it's there. Oh yes, remember this. Semi-safe stairs. All right. All right, we'll shut her down now again. For a bit until I get to the bottom maybe unless something exciting happens. Oh god I think we're almost here anyways. But anyways we'll just shut it down for a minute. Actually we got some pretty neat jungle sounds. Okay, wow, I think it's, I think we made it. Oh, holy shite. Time for a nap. <laughs> oh, boy. Well, that was, uh... hey, Peter, you want to go to see a couple temples? Yeah, sure. I have no idea. First off, it was about an hour and a half to get the first one. Ben Trey. I think I butchered that, but. And now, to the Thousand Lingus. If they described to me, you know, what it was, I might have said, oh, I don't know. I might have passed and went to an easier thing, but I'm glad I didn't have that option. Forced to go on this. All right. Okay. We made it. I don't know where he is. Probably napping somewhere. No, thank you. No, thank you. I know. I know, sweetheart, but I don't want anything. Okay. Thank you. Thank you.
a thousand Ingus and a Kulai Mountain here. It's about 12 noon. And we're just going to go back home. today so uh it's not really hot and riding in these open uh, tuk tuks it's very comfortable it's got a nice uh, shaded uh, roof and uh, it's all open so you get a nice breeze and you get a nice view 